I challenge you to meditate for two and a half hours straight. A lot of people aren't going to do it, but if you do do it, set a little timer maybe, dark room, just get rid of all the distractions, sit there, close your eyes, and then just focus on the senses and the moment, find yourself relaxing, and then suddenly you feel like you're floating, you can't feel your body, you focus on your forehead, and then now you're seeing all white, a white light, and you're floating in this void, and you feel this peace like nothing in the world even matters it doesn't exist it's just all sensations and you're just floating in this peace and eternal bliss like man <sighs> I was overthinking shit man I was thinking I was the waves I wasn't the ocean I wasn't the bottom the stillness I was the waves crashing chaotic on the top if I could become the still bottom of the ocean because they're all connected it's just the waves are on the surface level, and that's why they're chaotic. And yeah, that's your challenge. Meditate two and a half hours, and just really... And it's going to be hard. It's not going to be easy. There's going to be so many moments where you're just like, oh, this is so boring. I just need to go stimulate my brain. But don't do it. Don't give in. Like, you got to put in the work if you want to see the results. That's like my motto right now. Put in the work. See the results. Focus on the effort not the end result focus on the effort if you're focused on the success then you're going to give up when you don't succeed after like two tries but if you focus on the effort and you focus on consistent strong stable effort every single day that's going to get you the results well yeah just try it out and i promise if you do the whole two and a half hours it'll be a transformative experience you will come out of it knowing more about yourself and more. You feel more grounded and rooted in reality with a stronger understanding. For how I think of meditation is it's like when we're going about our lives normally without awareness, it's like when you're playing a game and you're so focused on the screen that the game is all that exists. You forget you're even holding a controller. I feel like when you meditate, you look down and you see you're holding a controller and the controller is your body and your emotions and this vessel that you're operating through and you look at it now when you're looking at the controller you have more control because you can go oh a means jump oh here's how i shoot here's how i run whereas if you're just staring at the screen so so immersed in the game you're just moving all over the place you might not even be like efficiently playing you might not be the best version of yourself so you look down at the remote and you're like wow i can uh, i can actually get good at the game now and getting good at the game is what I'm doing. But it's the big game. It's the real game. The game is life. Um, yeah. I love you guys. You better do your meditation. Or don't if you don't want to. But if you do, you'll probably grow. So, yeah. <laughs>